there everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude here and I'm here to review The Accountant. So The Accountant is directed by Gavin O'Connor who directed Warrior, a very great boxing film, and the film stars Ben Affleck, Anna Kendrick, J.K. Simmons, John Bernthal, John Lithgow, and Jeffrey Tambor. So The Accountant deals with the character named Christian Wolf who has autism, but he is also a very smart person. Ever since he was little, he grows up to be, well, the accountant. But Christian Wolf isn't your ordinary accountant. He is also an accountant that also does some business, to put it that way. But then because of what happened, it leads to Christian Wolf now going out on the run. So The Accountant is a film I was so hyped for. I love the trailers for this film. This looked like a very engaging and riveting, but most of all, a fun film. And I will say straight off the bat, that's exactly what I got when I came out of The Accountant. The Accountant is one of the most fun movies of 2016, one of the most riveting movies of 2016, and one of the most well-written and most well-directed movies of 2016. This movie was awesome. I freaking love this movie. This movie was so kick ass. And it was so kick ass to me because of how different it is from your normal thriller. Now, something about this film is that it's more of a drama film with just a couple of action scenes in there. This is not your action-packed kind of film, and I can see how people could be disappointed by that, because this movie focuses more on characters taking the time with its story. And I'm gonna be honest, even though this is a slow-paced film, I was never, ever bored. From the opening scene of The Accountant, I was sucked into this film. Although, yes, you don't really get your first action scene until like the first one hour, I'm not gonna lie, the first one hour was so engaging to me. So engaging that even if this film didn't have an action scene, I wouldn't be bored to be honest. I think this film actually could have still worked even if there was not a single action scene because I was so engaged by the storyline. The movie is written by a gentleman named Bill Dubuque. I'm pretty sure I butchered that. I am very sorry about that, but he did a great job directing this film. Everything felt organized. Nothing felt really honestly convoluted. It just took its time with the story and it paid off so well by the time you got to the end of the film and that's thanks to him and Gavin O'Connor also did a tremendous job directing this film. He knows how to get you sucked into the atmosphere. He did that with Warrior and he does the same thing with The Accountant and the cinematography for The Accountant. Oh my goodness. It looked fantastic. So many beautiful looking shots in The Accountant, to be honest, that actually took my breath away. And I just really liked how this movie made you think, like without spoiling anything, there's an opening scene. You have to kind of pay attention to this because you don't really see this certain clue again until the ending of the film. So there's even things you have to really pay attention to because they don't really explain it to you. But it's all like when you notice certain pieces coming together, it just made this movie that much better for me. It was just so good. And not only is this a thinking movie, but it was also a movie that was a lot of fun. Like this is definitely a film where although, yes, it's dramatic, it never gets to the point of being too dramatic. And that's where I do get to the humor. This film actually surprisingly had a good sense of humor because from the trailers I never got the vibe that they were going to add some kind of comic relief but no surprisingly there were actually some comedic moments in the film that gave the film more lightheartedness rather than it being this fully serious movie they actually do throw in some humor to add more of the fun factor and I really appreciate that. Everyone does a great job in this film. Ben Affleck is fantastic as Christian Wolf. You know, you really get behind Christian Wolf and you could see why he is the way he is because the film does do these flashbacks, which is something I will say. You don't get a whole lot of flashbacks, but whenever you do get a flashback, it does serve the story. It gives you a little viewpoint of what 
Christian Wolf had to go through as a child. And it's because of these flashbacks, it does serve for the character and you actually sympathize with the character more. Even from his facial expressions, you could see where he's coming from. And that's definitely a credit to the film. I was definitely invested with the flashbacks. Maybe there could have been a little bit more of them. Cause like I said, there weren't as much as I thought there was going to be, but for the flashbacks that were in this film, I thought they were great. And I thought they actually did serve for the story. And when it comes to the action, it actually felt pretty realistic to be honest in terms of how Ben Affleck would shoot and all that. It was actually quite great to be honest and it is pretty violent when the film needs to be but never to the point where it gets like anything too grotesque and something i have to say is that ben affleck definitely killed it with the action scenes because although you only get a couple for the choreography the shooting it all came together so freaking well in my opinion anna kendrick's also really good too i actually really liked this character and how she served as someone for christian wolf to talk talk to because Christian Wolf basically doesn't have anyone. Although I feel like maybe she could have had more to do in the film. I thought for what her character needed to do, she actually served her purpose very well, just being there for Christian Wolf. J.K. Simmons, I thought he was really great in this film. That's no surprise, J.K. Simmons. Just lately, he's been so awesome and the accountant is no exception with him. I forgot the actress's name, but she's Amanda Waller in Arrow, a show I actually do enjoy. Um, she's in the subplot where she has to find out who Christian Wolf is and all that. And I actually thought she did a very good job with her acting. And Jeffrey Tambor for the few scenes he had, he was really great. John Lithgow was really great. And John Bernthal. I also thought was a really, really great character and someone I don't really want to give too much about, but I actually thought his character was very, very interesting. I thought the score for the film was fantastic too. I thought it definitely did serve the story of where the film was going. Now, honestly, when it comes to my flaws with The Accountant, they're not really anything that takes me out of the story that much, but yes, there's a few problems I did have with this film and I will say that JK Simmons while he was great I did feel like he was underused he shows up really more in the second half but like for the first half of the movie you barely see him and I would have liked to see his character explored more in the second half his character actually does have this big backstory and it actually is quite a major scene in the second half which I thought was really great honestly I think it kind Kind of made up for the fact that he wasn't really in the first half that much this backstory he had was really great and i was 100 percent invested but i did wish that jk simmons was used just a little bit more in this film also there is a subplot dealing with this character maribeth once again played by that woman from arrow she investigates Christian Wolf, and I'll be honest, I wasn't really that interested with that subplot. I wasn't bored particularly, because luckily they don't really cut to that subplot for too long, besides for one major scene, which is in the second half, and I actually really like that part of the subplot, but... All the other parts I didn't find to be that interesting. I didn't really see that much of a point, to be honest. Like, it had a little bit of a purpose, but I feel like the movie wouldn't be any different, to be honest, if that subplot wasn't really there. There also could have been more scenes with Ben Affleck and Jeffrey Tambor because I actually did really like the scenes with both of them. I just wish that there was a little more to those scenes. And I will say the last problem I did have with this film is that the twist or the reveal I should say was honestly very very predictable I actually saw that twist coming a mile away I actually even called it at the beginning of this film but overall you guys that didn't take away from how much I love this movie this was a awesome badass thriller film and it's a different kind of thriller film where it's not always action-packed or anything like that but it does take its time with its characters the drama it does even have you think it was a very clever movie it's so well written so well directed it's so well shot so well acted there's so many great things about the accountant making it one of the best movies of 2016 so i'm gonna give the accountant three and a half out of four stars
So you guys, in the comments down below, let me know what you think about The Accountant. This is 22 Tiger Dude here, and don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power!